In this video, we are discussing loops in Java. For each programming language, there will be some looping construct. In case of looping, what will happen depending upon the condition whether it is true or false, some set of codes will get executed for multiple number of times and that is known as iteration or looping. So a loop statement allows us to execute a statement or a group of statements for multiple number of times. And this is the general form of the loop statement. So here you can find that the control is coming from here. The condition will be checked. If the condition is true, then this conditional block which might be containing certain number of statements will get executed. Again, the condition will be checked. And if the condition is still true, then the conditional block will be executed again. And in this way, the conditional block can have multiple time execution. But when that condition is false, it will come out from this looping and if the condition is false then control will come out and go on executing the next statements in the program. So what are the different loops in Java? So in Java there are basically three loops and they are while, do while and the for loop. So while loop, do while loop and the for loop. So there are the three basic looping constructs available in our Java programming. It also provides a for each loop which helps to choose all of the elements from a set of elements. So that is another kind of looping construct is available in our Java programming that is our for each loop. In the next videos, we will be discussing all these four looping constructs into further more details. Please watch all of them and thanks for watching this.